Next on the list here, we've got this really cool article courtesy of RA regarding a new listening bar that has opened up in Berlin called Bar Nero. Hmm, it kind of sounds a little bit like Bar Negro, but not too close, but not too far, right? It was Bar Nero, but it looks absolutely beautiful. Oh my God. I've got this um little dream of mine this little goal not a dream a, a goal of mine speak with intention and speak with conviction i've got a goal of mine that i'm going to achieve in the future of opening up my own nightclub if i don't open up my own nightclub the closest thing that i'd want to open up will be a listening bar even though for whatever reason in the uk listening bars always open and close for some reason they don't stay around for ages because maybe people want to party and whatnot i don't really know but the listening bar concept i love I love the listening bar concept. I honestly do love the listening bar concept. Um, I love the idea of going to somewhere and having it kind of being tuned um, by an audio file, being kind of, you know, designed in a way to bring the best out of the music from the flipping, you know, from the furniture that they use, the seats, the soundproofing, everything is kind of <coughs> designed in a way to make the place warm and to make it kind of palatable and to make it the best place possible to listen to great records and i like the fact that most of these places i've concentrate on only playing records lps actual vinyl and that kind of obviously resonates better with some sound systems and whatnot whereas maybe if it was me and i had a sound bar i might be the first one that has you know what it's digital only there is no vinyl maybe that might be a way to go about things but regardless anyway bar nero opens on april 6th um courtesy of ra it's a new listening bars opening up in berlin next month launched by analog foundation bar nero officially opens see every time i say nero i want to say negro but anyway, it continues will open its doors on april 6th located in um omst omstraza in Mitte, um its sister venue of the brewery studios a nearby recording studio also run by the analog foundation bar nero has been built and designed by recording engineer eric bauer eric bura sorry the acoustic design by longtime collaborator Aima sent some Einmar San Marti of Acoustics, Ascus Fink, sorry, wow, Brewer and San Marti have built more than 20 recording studios together around the world. Barniero is their first listening bar. The Bureau um, also bought Barniero's custom hi fi system, which is made up of premium vintage components such as an Altec A5 speakers, a Garrard 301 turntables, and a Shindo amplifier. In true Japanese audiophile fashion, the speakers are built with original components from 1950s. Imagine building this, kind of reminds me of like people who buy old cars but then they kind of soup them up to be modern you've seen that a lot of people of joe Rogan speaks about it a lot where people will buy like an old car like an old 50s car and just make sure all the components the engine the electronics are up to date but you know basically the engines are the same but the components are kind of so they can run sort of quote unquote normally whereas i like what these guys are doing they're rebuilding audio systems with the original components they're not trying to update them with the you know modern components which will kind of give the sound a different sort of texture you would imagine um we're really proud of our system and space which has truly been built with love says bro to a resident advisor from the vintage components we've sourced uh, for bar nero to the cutting lathe we're about to import from japan to the studio we are interested in the ways that this analog equipment makes creating recording listening to music special um the ethos of the analog is to one craft attention and care and beauty we're working to host guest selectors and bar patrons who enjoy this ethos as much as we do yes i can't wait to visit when i eventually go back to berlin it's gonna be flipping amazing have a look at some of the photos look at look at how beautiful this place looks look at the turntables look at the mirrors they've got on top of here it looks so good this wood all over the place you've got some nice bottles of booze here records everywhere the mirrors are interesting isn't it because i've i've never been to a listening bar so i'm sure there's a practical reason why these mirrors exist <clears throat> but these look really cool the size of the turntable are oh, the tables and the chairs look awesome I love the checkboard flooring, one of my key things. I love how the lights are slip up on here at the top. This kind of reminds me a little bit of the of the Innovision's retail store. I'm sure they still got it. It's commute, I think it's it Mutant to the Noise or whatever it's called. Innovision. They've got a store and it's got a similar sort of design here on the roof. <clears throat> You've got some pictures here of the speakers here that look really amazing. Wow. Love these. And yeah, Bar Nero, opening soon, April 6th. Check it out if you're around in Berlin. I'm definitely going to check it when I'm back there because I think I should be back there around the week of like April 22nd or something. So I'm definitely going to be checking it out when I do end up going there. So yeah, that's nice. Big up Bar Nero. Big up Bar Nero.